It all started in 1943, when Don Fraterno Vila Dinares decided to buy the Finca San Diego in Escuintla, Guatemala. Included in the purchase, a small plant, which produced only 340 tons of sugar a year. Don Fraterno never imagined the abundant fruits that would germinate from the seed he planted with hope and commitment. He had the vision, but it would have been hard to imagine the future magnitude of the project that carefully and courageously began 73 years ago. Corporación San Diego, a growth story. The young Fraterno Vila Betoret, son of Don Fraterno, enters the family business in 1958 with only 35 years of age and a very clear vision to build a bigger sugar mill, a dream that, with great skill, managed to materialize in 1965. With this, the production increased exponentially. In 1974, a generation of young directors gives new impetus to the already robust corporation. His vision turns in 1987 into the purchase of Ingenio Trinidad, a small and emerging sugar mill. Intelligent acquisition, as this has a privileged geographic location. It is the closest sugar unit to Puerto Quetzal, a place where the sugar terminal is located and exports to all over the world are handled. Guatemala is the fifth largest sugar exporter worldwide, a production that the country can export efficiently thanks to Expo Granel, its modern sugar terminal, with an installed capacity to ship more than 2,000 tons per hour. But what is the story behind the product? It all starts in the field. The cultivation is done under the cover of a productivity strategy that ensures one, use of available technology, two, the implementation of best cultivation practices, and three, the right balance in sugarcane varieties planted according to the altitude of the agricultural zone and contemplating the various cycles of maturation. Planting, weed and pest control, fertilization and irrigation are carefully controlled in digital systems that ensure the effectiveness of the process. Harvest time is an event of great logistic scale involving a large labor force and the use of machinery and specialized equipment. A complex and organized mobilization that aims to supply the programmed milling cycle. In the control tower, they have the exact location of the vehicles used to transport cane, sugar, fuel and the other transport units involved. Vehicles entering the sugar mill pass through scales capable of weighing up to four 35 feet long containers of cane. To achieve greater efficiency in the operation, the process is fully automated. The information is captured by a digital management system that monitors all activities at the sugar mill. Once the cane is received, the first step is to clean adhering soil. This cleaning, unlike the standard in the market, is done dry. No water is used, because water is a resource that deserves care. Once the cane is clean, we proceed to grind it to extract the juice through an operation that involves a set of five different mills. Then the produced sugar comes on conveyor belts to the storage warehouses. It has the capacity to store more than 27,000 metric tons of raw sugar and more than 37,000 metric tons of white sugar. The shipment is done through a careful process. Vehicles are loaded in a tunnel with gates that open only while the load is received from the crane. With this technology, it is guaranteed that the product is not exposed to any contamination. The product of this effort is obtained with a certification of Food Safety FSSC 22000. 
the gas. In other words, the squeezed sugar cane is transported to modern boilers, where it is used as fuel to generate the steam that drives the turbine generators that produce electricity for the operation of all the sugar mill. However, what is produced exceeds that which is consumed, so a considerable portion is sold to the National and Central American Network. The San Diego Corporation believes in an integrated development model which strengthens people while preserving the environment. That is why all water consumed is recycled, treated and used efficiently and consciously. The great value of the San Diego Corporation is its people. An operation of this magnitude would not be possible without the support of a team of professionals from different specialties and the dedication of thousands of collaborators who contribute their strength, knowledge and experience. San Diego seeks to give all employees a better quality of life. The owners of the land where cane is grown benefit from the lease of that land, making the business relationship a win-win for both parties. Thus, San Diego becomes a sustainable ecosystem that seeks the integral development of the country and the commitment to serve the world a quality product. This is a result of corporate social responsibility policies that prioritize the person and the environment above other interests. In 2005, the San Diego Corporation becomes the first to certify its manufacturing and marketing of sugar under the ISO 9001-2000 management system. Thanks to the acquisition of machinery, high technology equipment and to a heavy investment in infrastructure, today it has been possible to maintain a considerable upward trend in the production of sugar and energy. In 2015, the Quality Control Laboratory of the Trinidad Sugar Mill obtained the accreditation ISO 17025. It currently has the installed capacity of processing 15,000 tons of cane per day. But since growth is the only constant, the facilities are being expanded to grind 18,000 tons of cane per day in the coming years. All this has made the Ingenio Trinidad the sugar and energy producer with the highest rate of growth in the market, producing more than 210,000 metric tons of sugar and 132 megawatts of electricity per hour. Thanks to the design of strict processes, complying with international food safety standards, to a team determined to optimize the use of resources, as well as to the hard work and bold vision of shareholders, engineers and collaborators, after seven decades, the San Diego Corporation is listed as the most innovative and dynamic in the development of agricultural industry in the country and the region. San Diego is the story of a corporation that, even starting small, dare to think big and focus on innovation. The project of Don Fraterno Villa Betoret is today and always will be a growth story. <laughs>